Okay. Who was that guy that came up to our table? You know, the bald guy. I don't know. He looks so familiar, but I can't, like, put my finger on it. He looks really familiar to me, though. I know your sister-in-law, Melissa. We go way back. Oh, you do? She actually worked for me at a little gentleman's club in Elizabeth. Like, I know I know him, but I can't place where I know him from yet. <sighs> what? I feel my heart. I swear to God, I feel my heart. What? Do you feel it? No, I don't feel it, but what's going on? No, you need to really feel it because it's coming out of my shirt. What's Do you feel it now? Yeah. All right, well, I, before I came here, I just went to a salon. This guy works there. Who? That yeah. bold guy. I know him. I've seen him before. I just can't remember where I know him where from. Where do you know him from? I don't remember. Did you used to work for him or something? No, I don't think so. Why? Teresa, well, talk. Because he's, what? he said something about you and that, you know, and I, what did he say? He goes, this, that you used to work for him at, at a gentleman's club and used to dance for him. I know it's not true. So he said it. And then he comes up to you and says hi to you. And I'm like, so you know what I mean? So I'm thinking, oh, is it then she does know so, so do you think I was a dancer? No, I know you said that you were not a dancer. I was never a dancer. But then you're like, oh, I know you saw him. I do know no, him. I, I, knew, I knew I knew, him. Like, as soon as I saw him, I'm like, I I'm just saying, if that was me and you know that if somebody said that about me, well, I again, bartended. You understand? I bartended, but I bartended for him for a week because my cousin ran the place. And that was it. That was the end of it. Your brother knows. I told your brother. I did nothing wrong. I'm not ashamed of it. Technically, it's not a strip club, it's a bikini bar. You know, the guys, the older men with money, you hand them, like, here's your drink. Well, here's a $100 bill. It was, like, stupid not to work there, you know? Him and Kim D were talking, and she asked him, like, you know, details, like, when you did, you know, when you dance. And I don't know, I left the room. I didn't want to hear it. So why, you just believe? You get your heart like that over what some stranger said? No. First of all, I was a school teacher. It's very different from being a dancer. When your brother met me, I was a school teacher. You understand that, no, right? No, you were going to college. To and I was teaching second grade. Oh. No, I know during the day, but I, you know, he's, I don't know, at night. It's not true. Why would you I, believe that? I didn't believe it. That's why I walked through him. I told him I didn't want him to talk about my family. You're my sister-in-law. Well, that's okay. And you're married he, to my brother. He, and I love you, and I love my brother, and I don't want him saying that about you. So you should go up to him and say, listen, why are you- I don't care what he said. But why is he, like, spreading these rumors? Because he's an asshole. Anyway, Here's Melissa is the dance for me. <laughs> okay. You know, like, now Teresa knew about it, too. I mean, I think it's so funny. Yeah, so, anyway, Johnny calls me up and says that something like you know, Kim and Teresa want to blow the whistle on her. If she plays, like, a holier than now. They had me do this thing, you know, like, Melissa, wow, I didn't, almost didn't recognize you. You look fabulous. 